Hi everybody, uh, today I want to talk a little bit about inflation. You know, um, everybody's seeing it. We're told it's not real, it's temporary, so I don't know. But as a general rule, things tend to get more expensive over time. So let's just stick with that for right now. Whether you believe right now we're in an inflation period or not, over time there's going to be one. So then where's the best place to put your money to um, hedge against inflation? Guess what? Real estate, right? So because here's the basic concept, uh, one of them that makes it makes makes so much sense is that you pay today's price for something that you pay for typically over a period of 30 years, or you pay today's price, so you pay cash for it. But it, it it generally will appreciate over time if you have it and you rent it out. Your rents will go up, your value will go up, and your rent will go up. So. Um, the main thing to keep in mind is that right now, if you buy today, you're buying before inflation happens, the next inflation wave happens, and therefore you're gonna you're gonna get equity in your home. Then, and the thing to keep in mind also is that this isn't like a get rich quick. This isn't flipping houses. This isn't making money fast. This is the tried and true, proven method where most people get most of their wealth. Um, is, is through buying a home. Um, it's a patience game. So you just have to buy your home and hold it. That If you do that, you will make a lot of money over time. Um, even if nothing else, you're paying yourself your mortgage. So it's, a, it's, it's incredibly important. And you have to hold on to it to make that happen. You keep turning over, then you keep just playing the inflation game along with it, which is still not a bad idea, but not the key way. So let both inflation and real growth occur while you're living your life. So you can just keep doing what you're doing and make money um, on the side. As long as you don't sell, you'll make money. And then when you do sell, you make hopefully a lot of money. And then you have to assume that inflation is going to happen. You, you know, um, over time, it's going to happen. It, it may not happen this year. It may not happen this next three years. But over time, things just keep going up. If you haven't noticed that, you haven't been paying attention. And institutional buyers know that with inflation, they're going to see a rise in prices and rents. And so they can finance them now, especially now while mortgages are so low. So they can buy them at today's prices, finance them at a really low interest rate, and then watch inflation just take care of their their. Um, bank accounts for them. So if you're looking for an investment that's largely inflation proof, you should consider buying real estate. I hope that was helpful.